guys, we're here again. It's life and times, you know what I'm saying? We're, 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 this this episode should have happened probably six months ago. <laughs> if, we're, if we're being completely honest. But, guys, what all that matters is that we're here now. You know what I'm saying? I say that a lot. Life is hard. But anyway, guys, we're here with you know somebody that I think is very original. Definitely has great music. Funny man, a good friend of mine. You know what I'm saying? We're we're here with our our good friend. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Shit, O I M, aka OG on Marco. But yeah, you know all the homies shit just call me Marco and shit. If you're friends, yeah, that's what it matters. If you know me, you know me. If call me Marco. Exactly, but. It's all I am for everybody. <laughs> but anyway, guys, how you doing, man? You good? Yeah, yeah, it's great, cool. You, you finally back from your fucking Lewis and Clark journey, this nigga. Man, I'm, shit, I'm about to dip again. That's what I was, I bro. I don't stay put. I don't like to stay put. It's nah. too, it's too predictable. I'll be gone. You said you can let them know your next step. Not even. I just like to be gone. I just like to be on the road. Nah, I'm already in the city because I was. That's really the reason why that is it ain't happening because he, this man, be moving for sure everywhere. For sure. For sure, phone tag for sure. Every sure. every every week, I think I literally talk to this nigga every week talking about your year. <laughs> oh, y'all leave on Wednesday. bro, on bro, yeah. It's it's crazy, but you know, let's 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 just go ahead and dive into it. You know what I'm saying? Where are you from? Let's get our background going. You know Shit. what I'm saying? From Jacksonville, Florida, North Florida, pretty much. You know. That shit. It's hot as fuck. That's <laughs> hot as shit over it's there. Humid as hell. For nothing. Humid as hell. Ain't ain't really shit going on like with scenery out there. It's it's ugly. Isn't it just mad water? Mad water, mad trees. It's real country. Country, ratchet. It's it's high though. If you it depends on where you are, it's high. I mean, so like from like kind of coming from there, because we had one other person that's from there too. Shout out to Walker. You know what I'm saying? But like what what was it kind of like growing up there, like, you know, as a kid and shit like that? I mean shit. Really as I was growing up, I grew up skateboarding and shit. But really, really? Yeah, I grew up skateboarding a lot. I I'm I'm actually real raw with that shit. No cap. Right, right now. Probably I don't skate no more. I mean I you retired that I retired that shit probably like a year ago, like two I, years ago. Ain't that ain't a long time. You could probably pick it back nah, up. Nah, I could. It's um, it's like riding oh. a bike for me. It's like yeah. But when my come out with a brother, he skateboarding and shit. So I got with him with it. Mm. But other than that, I mean, I just when I I ain't gonna lie, just getting in a lot of trouble on just like little kid shit. You gotta learn. Yeah, yeah you gotta yeah. learn. Yeah, but and then from, here. so then through the through the skateboarding thing, how did you kind of figure out that you wanted to? uh Kind of pursue the music thing, or did that come I mean, way later? Because I always grew up listening to a lot of music and shit. So I already, me and the homies, we fuck around and shit already on the phone, just making just dumb troll shit. Like not even really taking this shit serious. <laughs> like we just fuck around. We had a phone. It was the uh, I remember it was like the little slide up phone. <laughs> you had the yeah. chocolates and shit or the fucking it was, it was like No, not even that. It was some whole other shit. It was some whole other shit. But I remember we uh. Me and my homeboy Zay, we made a song on that bitch. On some like just fuck around shit. We was really just trolling, like mm. in middle school, just trolling and shit. But I really didn't start. I probably made my first song probably like 2015, 16. Might have been 17. I don't mm. even remember. But my first song kind of went up in the city a little bit. And then shit from now, I was like, shit, I'm just going to take it. But honestly, all my old shit ass. All that shit ass. <laughs> like, I mean, it's supposed to. Some be people, your... I'll, I'll be deleting shit, and people will message me and be like, "Yo, like, where that song?" I'm like, "Bro, that shit was ass." Don't delete it. You're supposed to keep it on there. You just not for sure. It shows your sure. growth. You know what I mean? Like, not for, for some, sure. You know? We growing from right here. They gonna see everything from right here. We <laughs> this, this is where we gonna go from right here. He deleting everything after this. No, I mean, but not everything. Some shit still up there. Of course, nah, I mean, but, I, I, I yeah. hear. I mean. What what like what was the music scene out there like? Like I know that's a very generic question, but so you know what the, I mean. The music scene out there, how could I put it? It's like, you know what I'm saying. Like I don't really fuck with too many people. It's like I fuck with their music, and like I ain't got no issues with nobody. But like I don't really be too much in the mix out there. Like I fuck with my people, Fast Finesse Gang. Mm-hmm. You know my shit, Stan Gang, and then you know I really just yeah. be. Be us. I I don't I don't want to sound like I'm holding people out, but it really when I wake up daily basis like that's who I'm with. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Jacksonville at least. Yeah. But the music scene is, it's, it has so much potential. It has so much potential. Like I'll do shows in Jacksonville, mm-hmm. and they will be turned. 
Cause yeah. I, I, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people will do shit. They'll try to, uh, they try to get a show together and put like 30 niggas on the show. 30 niggas, that shit didn't be a talent show. Yeah, that's like a- I'm not trying to rock with it. You know, I ain't trying to go and then on top of it, they trying to charge at the dough for the shit. It's kind of like, yeah. but me, I don't know. I mean, I personally put money out there myself and I'll get a spot, I'll get a venue, get the speakers, get a stage, get everything for free. And I'll just tell people, pull up, free show. Yeah. And that shit will pack out every time. So it's like, the city got potential for sure. The city got so much potential. It's, it's just, more like everybody's trying to make a quick dollar off certain shit instead of just doing it for the culture? Or It's just, I'm trying to think of a way to say that shit. Like the scene, it's... Everybody can rap real good. Everybody can make good music, mm-hmm. but it just doesn't like it. Just don't the whole look. It just don't resonate. Don't, it don't go. Like, yeah. yeah, you gotta really be fine with the shit. Like it just don't really. Go. Yeah, I'm just curious because it's like your your style of how you make music, and especially through like your last couple projects. Obviously, you've seen you're, you're sharpening the sword. You're getting. For it's show, getting better, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's it's getting more refined and more poignant. Yeah. But it's like that's what I'm saying. I've never heard anybody from that side sound like you. So it's yeah, like, that should be yeah. I ain't gonna. I, I be hearing that a lot too. And like honestly, on some shit, I remember this shit. Like I remember this shit so clear. I remember me and Walker. We shot a video. We shot that tambourine video. I just said now we about to and get then, yeah. We about to get into that for sure. So me and Walker <laughs> shot that tambourine video, and then Walker was on some shit. He's sending out to the uh, Duval promo. It's like a praise for the uh, city at Duval promo, whatever, whatever mm-hmm. fuck. And he sent it to him, and then he was like, yo, can you post this? And the nigga wrote back talking about, this don't sound like a nigga from Jacksonville. <laughs> I was like, fuck wrong with buddy? I'm like, I'm like, nigga, nigga low-key lame. Like, that's, fucked, that's fucked up. Nigga said, damn, I can't get on this bitch, but you fucking around. You put Kodak Black and goddamn, you put a, a relevant shit, shit on there. But a nigga yeah. from the city, because I don't sound like I'm from the city. I can't get on the page. But I, you know, I ain't never messaged buddy and be like, yo, put me yeah. on the page. It was just. Yeah. It was you know just trying to make the, yeah, it was trying to make the video. Bro, send it to him, and then I seen him. I'm like, nah, he lame. I don't ever want to be on that shit. That's, nah, that's crazy as hell. That's why I don't really be in the mix, bro. But I but that's I mean, but I think that's that's a good thing though. I mean, in 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 you know, in retrospect, you bro, know, it's what a saying? great thing not to sound yeah. like all these other niggas. It's a great thing. Yeah, because I said so, I never when I when I first met you, which I'm I've known you for like years, some change, right? Mm-hmm. But like I didn't I didn't know what the fuck you were from. Like I could, I couldn't tell at all. And then hearing the music, that should be unpredictable because I be so in different spots. I fuck around being in Atlanta and then New York, and then like I'm tied in with some niggas in Detroit. Like I, yeah, n- New York. I be everywhere, so it'd be unpredictable. And then I say I'm from Florida. Like it ain't, I don't never be hiding that shit. I be like, Sean from Florida, North Florida. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So it's like, it's it's it's. I mean, it's a great thing. Like you said, it's a great sure. thing to sound so different and also to have so many ties in so many places that no one can really ever. You know, guess. You know what I mean? But even since you since you did talk about the tambourine video, that fucking song, that's how I found out about you initially without knowing it was you. Yeah. Like if that if that makes sense. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. um, like so that that video ended up getting passed around so many times because the video is, you know, fucking that's yeah, the video like video go crazy. That's like that yeah. was probably the video of the year, to be honest that's with you. His, nigga like, Walker Snap was that one, like I Talk love, about it. How I how did Walker. that even happen? So, you know what I'm saying? Walker from Jacksonville already, so yeah. as it is, you know. Um, we was always, like, kind of like how we were, like, trying to, we were going to get to it when we got to it. But he cleared up on space, and I was like, shit, let's do it. Mm-hmm. So then he, like, wrote out a whole treatment for the video, and, like, in my head, like, he told me, he was like, yeah, I'm writing a treatment for the video, but I wasn't thinking too much about it. I'm like, all right, cool. Then, like, two weeks go by, he's like, all right, Ben, I'm ready on Thursday. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, cool, yeah. come on, let's shoot it. Mm-hmm. Pull up. Like, he really got everything ready. He got his little, got the crew, got everything going on. Like, he had everything plotted out in his head. Like, mm-hmm. that boy is a genius. I ain't going to lie. That boy is uh, a genius. Facts. And then he shot that bitch and, like, I didn't get that bitch back for, like, a little minute. But, like, and I remember I was, I'd hit him. I'd be like, damn, where my video at? But, like, when that shit came back, I was like, yeah, but take your time anytime yeah, you need. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah, yeah. that shit snapped, like. He he did a lot snapped. of things. He did a lot snapped. of things in that video that I, I there, I mean, shit. He kind of rewrote, you know, editing for a while. Like I'm not gonna lie, there was you know niggas was trying to do all that stitching and shit like that. And then the song itself was so unorthodox mm-hmm. to where it was, yeah, was like that was produced by Digital Noise. That was my first song really? that I got with him because on some whole edit <laughs> shit like Nas came to the city and um he tapped in with me. I tapped in with him and then he sent me that beat. Then we. That shit went from there. I made that yeah. song with him, and I was like, "Damn, shit hard." Fuck it, Walker. Let's shoot this bitch. Yeah, no, nah, like that's that's, that's my that's my turn up song. Every time I do a show, like that's the one that be most turned because it's like it's kind of it, like your breakout song, damn near. 
it's damn near there. I just the thing is I don't ever put no promo behind my shit. So it's more like if a song hit, it hit. Yeah. So and, like, but that one, like I said, but it was you know, regardless of the song being so different, you can't categorize it. You, you know can. what I'm saying? That's why I be listening. I be listening to shit. I'm like, damn, like this shit sound different. It's like I'm gonna I'm gonna get back on that way. No, as you should. I mean, and then even and even from there, so because that was that was on a tape, right? That was that was I can't remember the name. I just remember the cover. It was like a all. It's like a white looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It was I already dropped that yeah. bitch, but then I just slapped it on a project. Yeah, and then just and on. just to do it, and then like I said, it's 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 just one of those things where it was like I said, I figured that out before I even met you. And mm-hmm. then you switch the name, and I want to know why you switched the name. Why well, I switched my rat name? Yeah, because because so I was like, like, so like already as it is. All right, so because it's OG Young Marco. Yeah. But in my head, like you know, I didn't really give a fuck. I was just like the OG, like O, mm-hmm. and then the Young Y, mm-hmm. and then the Marco M. So I was like, oh, O I M. And then I went, I dropped the chain, O I M. Mm-hmm. And like even before that, I was always just screaming, just O I M on my songs mm-hmm. and like the little intro, like my ad libs and shit. And I was like, I just want to change it up, just O I M. It's just yeah. different. It's like no, it it's is. three letters. You know what I'm saying? For yeah. like someone that don't even see me, they're just, just gonna be like Oim or something like that. You feel me? <laughs> yeah, so you gotta yeah, know yeah. to know type shit. Like but that, you that know. is not like a fucking you know ad lib or shit like that. Yeah, it's, it's just O I M. Like you know, so people would call me and they'd be like O I M. Like pick up the phone, be like O I M. But, no, yeah, literally. Cause but I mean, I just switched it because I wanted it shorter too. I didn't. I just hated like people be like, "What's your rap name?" I'd be like, "OG and Marco." I feel like it's a lot to say. Eh, it is a mouthful. It's a mouthful, like. like for but it's sure, still like, like. But it's it was still like. But it's cool though because people yeah. still gonna know me as like my Instagram handle is that. Yeah. My YouTube, everything is still that. So it's like you gonna know. Yeah. But it's like OIM is the like what it's gonna be underneath the music. Are you gonna change it though? Like like completely, like my page? Complete, yeah. Like all all your probably, socials to probably make it not. I'll probably just keep that shit OG and Marco because I want you to just you just know like mm. I don't want you to forget about OG and Marco like what it stands for. Mm. You feel me? So I probably I'll probably just keep that shit the same. I tried to buy the uh the Instagram page. I tried, I talked to him. He, he wasn't <laughs> he budging. He wasn't going for it. He wasn't he budging. Was, he wasn't going for he it. He wasn't budging. I was trying to get that shit. He know the shit about to pop up. He was like, Nah, I'm good. He's like some dude from like. I fuck with him though. Like he be joining my Instagram lives and shit like that. It's, we be we be chatting. No okay, care. We be chatting. It's, it's kind of funny that like I feel like a lot of people try to do that for like certain handles yeah. and no one ever gets a response. So, nah, like, he be like, he be replying liking my shit, reposting my shit, and he only got like twenty followers. He kind of so. hating for that, like, or like, like he kind of <laughs> hating for that, like he just kind of. I, I, I get he you. got to it first. I can't hate on him. It's like okay, whatever. But like, I asked him for that bitch. I wanted that. One. Okay. No, nah, I, I try to do the same thing. They try to take the fucking uh, underscore out my name, and there's a nigga that got the same shit. He not coming for it. He like some type of family nigga. Nigga not budging. Like at all. <laughs> like bro, just make a new one, bro. You don't even really like. No one's looking for you, gang. Like you know what I mean, but it is what it is. I'm you know, not budging on it. I, I tried like a lot of times. I mess <laughs> randomly like, yo, I can get that yet. <laughs> every every couple months, it's like yo, <laughs> you be it's coming, like you gonna see him on my shit. You be coming like fire emojis or type of shit. Like he turned. I fuck with bro though. That's, bro, yeah. You say he's, he's not from America. Bro, he's not from America. He can't be. He can't, he can't be. <laughs> he got a picture at least on the, on the page. Bro, yeah, like bro, he's not. I mean, I could be tripping, but he take me for them niggas that is overseas. He take me for that type. He, he could be. I mean, anyway, but so that's hilarious. But yeah. anyway, so as far as that goes, you know, you're, you're you are more than just like you know rapping and things of that nature because <clears throat> you record yourself too. Obviously, we talked about that as well. <clears throat> but I want to also talk about. I mean, like the clothing stuff and everything that you've been doing. It's actually very, very nice. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Kind of, do, are you, did you try, did you design it yourself or did you have some so, help or how did that kind of come pretty about? Pretty much like what happened with that shit, same thing is with Walker. So, you know, me and Walker used to live with each other and shit. He made, he made a cover for me and that OIM logo was in the back. And I was like, man, hold on, crop that out and then send that to me. And it says OIM on I was like, crop that out, send it to me. Mm. And that's whenever I was like, man, I'm putting this on clothes. <laughs> So I just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, exactly. I just put the logo on the clothes, mm-hmm. put in the put on nice fabrics and shit like that. Mm-hmm. That's pretty much that. It's damn near like merch though. Like when I really start mm-hmm. making clothes, like clothes, clothes for real, it's not gonna be that logo. It's gonna be like some whole other shit. Yeah, no, and, and I like mean, like merch. I said, it's it's it, like you said, it's merch. But I'm saying, as far as like somebody's first merch run, yeah, no, nah, that shit's not. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And then especially for you to do like sweatsuits and shirts and shit like that, mm-hmm. like it's it's way more advantageous than just doing a shirt. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's just like. And it looked really nice, you know, down the pants leg, you know what I'm saying? Stuff mm-hmm. like that. Even though this nigga has not 
made me one, which is fucking insane. But it's all right. Fuck me. It's all right. It's cool. Nah, gang. I ain't even going to lie. Like, I could really buy that beer right now. I ain't going to lie. I'm just saying. I, I pay you for it, nigga. I'm trying to tell you. I'm here to support. You know what I mean? <laughs> now you good. I, I tweaked. I meant, to, I meant to come bring you some. I it's, it's, it's all right. I'm trying to see you. Know, pop, out, pop out to the spot. You already know what it is. Support your friends, guys. It's, that's the whole point. That's, that's the message of today. But no, so even getting from between that, I want to. I also want to talk about the the meet the stainer shit that you keep posting. Mm -hmm. I want you to explain. I want you, let's, let's get into that. So we can get into that. I want, right now. Yeah, I want to get all into the new shit. So that's now. that's gonna be that's gonna be the project. That's gonna be the project that's gonna change shit for sure, one hundred percent. That's gonna be the one. And pretty much picture a cover. I'm trying to think. Should I even, should I even leak? Yeah, that you should. Thing, Tell them to leak it. Leak it. Leak no, it. Talk leak, about how, it. Should I leak the cover? Like how mm -hmm. it's even like. All right. So pretty much, it's gonna be like, it's like meet the Fockers, right? You seen? Yeah. Y'all seen that movie? But Ben Stiller. And then yeah, you know what I'm saying with all the old people in that shit, everything. Yeah. So like, bro, it's gonna be me. I'm trying to still decide if I'm gonna do old people or my niggas and shit. Yeah. But then it's gonna be the same font. Meet the Stainers. Yeah. Me and me, damn near. Yeah, so it's, so it's, it's like it's like a whole introduction. That's yeah, that's why I'm gonna do a whole project with that. That's all shit. And then just meet the standards. That's gonna be the project. That's gonna be the one. That's that's gonna drop sometime this year. Like when that shit ready. It's gonna how, how how many like I, what's the percent of it that's done? What do you think? That shit damn near done, but it's like I just keep recording and making better shit. So it's like <laughs> it's never. That's why that's why I'm that's why I'm delaying it, mm -hmm. and I'm just dropping singles, and I'm just in I'm in the booth just working and shit because I'm trying to see like. I want all the shit to fit. You know what I'm saying? I'll be around homies and shit and I'll play like what I'll be making and shit. Like, damn, bro, put this on the project. Like, they'll say all that shit hard, but it's like, I really need to like, so I'm going to sit down myself and really just figure out what's really hard and what's really going to go. Like, I'm going to put shit on there that people said they didn't fuck with. Because I want to, if I fucked with it and they said they didn't fuck with it, I'm going to still drop it. Yeah, no. Nah, so I got faith in like my, my light years and yeah. what's going on with that. No, I mean, a lot of people... A lot of people, I think, are very influenced by the people around them to say yeah or nay, mm -hmm. especially the people that you got around you because those aren't just regular people. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? So I want to, I think that's commemorable as well, but it's like, I feel like at the same time, if you're going to do like, uh, like, it's like a super long tape, like, give me, give me some more. I'm very curious. <laughs> like, bro, like, really, bro, it ain't going to be that long, bro, because mm -hmm. I don't really like long projects unless I'm ready for my whole album. I'm not. Yeah. Because, like, this damn near, I don't even know. This shit could turn into an album. You feel yeah. me? Like with with the growth that they could, but right now it's just a tape. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm looking at probably like 11, 12 songs. I'm not trying to OD yeah. it, yeah, because I don't want to get them too much yet. I'm I'm not trying to OD and drop drop project 20, yeah. 25 songs. <laughs> it ain't it ain't nah, that yet. It yeah. ain't it ain't that yet. But it's that's some shit in the future. It's on the way. Uh -huh. But I, I want to say too, since this is you know starting up too. I mean, like you're getting into the whole. I'm gonna do my video, you know, doing your videos yourself type shit. Cause you just dropped a video. Yeah. I'm gonna put it in the description too. Everybody go check that out. Like, there's not a lot of rappers that do that. Period. Yeah, Cause point, I like point. I like to get behind my shit. You know, like same thing with like recording myself or like I don't know. Anyone that's ever shot a video of me gonna tell you, like, yeah, you be kind of picky with shit. Like, I need to really sit there and watch you do that shit mm -hmm. and like put certain clips. Cause I know in my eyes what looks cool. Yeah. Same thing with my ears. I know when I hear, I know it sounds cool. So it's like, that's why I went. I bought a little camera. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I, my lifestyle is already so lit. Like, I'm not yeah. even trying to like brag or nothing, but like, I already be doing mm -hmm. so much shit. So I'll pass the camera to someone, they could just record. Yeah. You don't even need, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't even care. That shit look professional. You feel me? <laughs> yeah, just yeah, like, yeah. yo, bro. It's just, happening. Yo, bro, like, record this. Like, you know what I'm saying? I went to Hawaii, bro. Like, just, yo, record this real quick. Yeah. And they had no camera experience. Yeah. And that's how that video came out. Yeah. You were and saying I, that. And I edited it myself. Like, I just, I, I sequenced it and I sent it off to my dog, K-Baby, for additional edits. Like, I don't know how to, like, do the additional edit part yet. yeah. But I'm learning like how to sequence and live shit like that because I know in my eyes will look cool and I know like when I'm holding the camera get my B-roll shots and shit like if you see any B-roll in my videos it's me that shot that bitch. <laughs> God damn. Every that's single hard. every single clip of like that's mm -hmm. not me and it's something else I shot that bitch. Shit. And it's just and it's just For like that last video like yeah, this, from, this the... what I'm on right now Tysh. I'm gonna let Nick, other niggas still shoot my shit. No yeah yeah exactly. But like, you just wanna be more involved. Yeah you know I'm, I'm always involved in my shit. I, like, I just like to I like to just, I know what's going to look cool. And I know, like, you know what I'm saying? When I'm shooting, 
I'll be like, damn, like that. I know in my head when I do something like that was that was cool. Yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna cut that clip. <laughs> I'm gonna put that on and for sure. Talking about I gotta remember that shit. I gotta remember it. Yeah. No, and I and I get it. It's I mean not a lot of I mean not a lot of artists do that. You hear a lot of artists just say you know I let the cameraman do their thing and you know kind of be that you know what I'm saying. So mm-hmm. it is a different flavor just by itself to to be able to frequently sit there and do your shit like you know what I'm saying and actually edit shoot and whatever. I mean because yeah. at the end of the day you're gonna know what you want. You know what I'm saying. But so. but I want to. Are you? What are you editing on? Huh? <laughs> what are you? <laughs> I'm about to fuck you up. What are you editing on? So look, bro. I'm nigga like say something crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so look, I ain't even gonna lie to you. I'll be on some free shit. I don't even know what the fuck this shit is called. Cap cut. Like, I've never. Heard I'm not of gonna that. lie to you, like gang. Like I tried to. Uh, I'm on MacBook. I don't know what's on my MacBook. I'm trying to like get like iMovie and shit like that and other shit, but it won't let me get it. It only let me get Cap cut. <laughs> I don't know why my cut laptop took it, so I was like, "Yeah, cut the cap and cut let me get some cap. other shit." But that shit, I mean, I, I sequenced it on that shit. And it worked. That though, shit's I mean, ass though. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I mean, I don't know if it's my computer, but that shit just be moving slow as hell. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get that final cut. I feel like I'm being cheap. How old you? Nah, don't get, bro. You get final cut. You might as well. I'm gonna um, learn the whole nine. I'm, I'm gonna learn all bro, this. Bro, only sluts. I might start taking commissions. Bring me your video I'll your shit up I'll, 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 I'll get it up I'll right now show. You know 24 hours and less Be right back to you But now you gotta get Premiere bro Stop playing Premiere bro. yeah Premiere is what you wanna get Cause then like I'm gonna I'm grab that hoe Man cause fucking Final Cut is fucking hell like I just need Yeah for sure like, I, I, don't, I don't need nothing Too special bro Like You know what I mean But you want something That's gonna work I think yeah. that's like The biggest no, I'm, thing I'm gonna get that That's what some niggas Like telling me to get that shit Yo is that You gonna start streaming too Nigga, everything, bro. Like, from streaming to, bro, I want to start my own cartoon. You were telling me, or you posted it out. Yeah, what? I was going to do like a real life show, like some real funny ass shit, but I was like, hell no, nah, I'm going to just do a cartoon. Like, but like, I don't, even wanna, be about? I don't even want to leak that shit yet. Oh, you're a bitch. Uh, they might try to run with the sauce. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I didn't give a fuck, bro. Yeah, I'll tell you what no, that shit well, is. Well, well, like, what's, what's the premise? Right, so like, what's the premise? My my plot is to get this bitch on, like, an adult adult platform. It's going to be, like, some real nigga shit, damn near. Mm. It's like, it's a superhero, but he a nigga. But he don't save hoes. <laughs> don't save hoes. It's, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm still trying to figure out, like, I might just name I might name a Mr. Nigga. <laughs> if, not, if it ain't Mr. Nigga It's gonna be super nigga like, It's I'm gonna be to something crazy Yeah And it's gonna be funny as hell Cause I got plots for that shit And I got like I be in my career Like riding on my phone And shit I got some yeah. I got some real deal plots For that shit huh? When the bag come a little bit more And shit That's when I'm gonna do it I, I was thinking about Just dropping money Out my own pocket To get an episode And going into like Adult swim And be like Yo can you cut me a budget Cause yeah. that shit Gonna be hilarious I think I mean I think the biggest thing too It's like Finding like a good animator, like an animating company. That's another thing with it too. That's a whole other thing with it too. I need that shit to be crisp, like on some fucking, like on some like damn near like the Boondocks type shit, but not like in that, not in that cartoon shape, but like in that quality. Uh, but in the quality, yeah. So from there, so the, so the, so you were looking for you know doing the cartoon thing, and I mean, is that something you you've always wanted to do that or like? It's- Hell yeah, I've always wanted my own little show. I've always wanted my own show, like mm-hmm. so. This is a way for me to do it. Is like a cartoon. I physically don't got to be in that bitch. And it's like, I could just, you know what I'm saying? Like get a whole yeah. crew. You feel me? And I don't got to be on that bitch. You don't want to voice nobody? I'll probably voice some shit. For sure. I, I'll, def- I'll definitely yeah. voice some shit. You got to voice at least one person. I, de- I might be the main character to voice that shit. I don't know. It, depend- it depends on everything. Like that's, that's all in like the long run. That's down the road for sure. Mm. Probably like, like I said, like once I finish this rap shit. I'll probably do it in the mix. I, said, I feel like you'd be I'll fine if you did it in the mix. I'm gonna do it in the mix. You know, yeah, I'm definitely gonna do it in the mix. I ain't, you know, I like I like doing different shit. No, I was saying you shit. you've always been a, a nigga of different trades and things of that nature. Yeah, I like because that's you know I, that's just how I grew up, just doing funny ass shit, watching cartoons. You know, just shit like that. I always wanted my own cartoons. So yeah, I mean, and then even with that, like, how do you? How do you feel about just being like a kind of an artist but wanting to do these other outlets like that might not be anything in the same group? I'd be as wondering artists. in my head sometimes that like, cause I don't want to. That's why I don't want to do it yet. Is cause I don't want to be looked at like, 
what else to do with that TV show or that's that dude with like let's say yeah. I do some other shit and that shit blows up before the music that's mm. when they look at you like that you know what I'm saying yeah. so like fuck around if I became like a fucking this never happened but like if I became like a YouTuber mm-hmm. and I blew up as a YouTuber they gonna look at me like oh that's that funny nigga on YouTube yeah you feel me? Kind of yeah. like fuck up your whole motion with the shit. Unless like you really, really hard. Like you really yeah. fucking hard. You could just do both and they, you know, there's no, there's that's no like, actual that's, fuck that's up. And that's like rare for like, that's super rare. I mean, for, I mean, uh, depends. I mean, you can kind of like, kind of like Eddie Murphy it. You know what I'm saying? Where you got, yeah. you got, you got the comedy thing and then he just made comedy movies, but like, that's a whole people, different. That's whole. That's different. But people think of him was like a movie star than they do like a. a when comedy. I look at him, I'm like, that's an actor. Yeah, but like he's technically like a stand-up comedian before like anything else. That's true. You know what I'm saying? True. But you're right though too that that shit died out and niggas just like that shit like, go hand in hand damn near. So it's different, you know, like mm-hmm. I, like that stand-up comedy and all that shit it go hand in hand. Like mm-hmm. when you're doing shit like like being a YouTuber and then the music, I mean it go hand in hand. But like yeah, I didn't seen a lot of niggas that were like funny YouTubers that try and rap shit and it's kind of like. <laughs> I mean, I see. I mean, it's the same thing. I feel like basketball players and baseball basketball players. Basketball players, like, unless you hard as fuck, bro. Like, what's burning? I think Damian Lillard is like the only good rapper. Like, out of like, like the entire league, because niggas, niggas aren't niggas be trying to do anything. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, some niggas be hard as hell because a lot of them, a lot of niggas came from the streets. So it's like, but some, but like, I don't know, man. Like, it be it be certain shit where I'd be like, bro, there's no way you was doing that. Like who are you? Who, they might have been. Whose uh, life are you talking about? about? I don't know, they man. Might have been, bro. They had to get up, get up out of there, and start shooting them hoops instead of shooting them glass. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> God, I fucking hate you. <laughs> they just had to go shoot some. I mean, it's one of two, right? It's one of it's one of the two. You coming out, you coming out over there? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. I couldn't, I couldn't do sports. You did sports? Um, like I said, I skateboarded and shit, and like just, just skateboarding like, none of us. Played basketball a little bit, just a little shit. Like I played everything on some like when I was a kid, I played everything, every sport damn near, like any sport you mm-hmm. can name. Like I, I did it all when I was a kid and shit. But now you're not a kid no more. You had to grow up, get to this money. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just fucking tired. You guys are really fucking <laughs> tight. But no, but I mean, but even from there, like you said, like you know when you said you were talking about like, kind of reverting back to the to the clothing thing because I kind of want to yeah. touch on that too. Cause you're, you know, you know, you out here, you, you be, you be, you be doing your thing. You know what I'm saying? He didn't wear none of his shit though, which is crazy. But because I didn't want to be that dude. But you gotta be that dude if you. Try and I've to been like, wearing that shit like OD, so it's like I don't want to be OD. And I've been wearing my, I wear my tracksuit a lot, so it's like mm-hmm. I fuck around. I shot a music video in that bitch like yesterday, <laughs> day before that bitch. And <laughs> yo, he's in the same fit. You feel me? Like, Not even. It's just like, bro, they like to see different shit. All right, different nah, fits. I ain't mad at you, but nah, yeah. but it's is is making an actual brand kind of something that you've been toying, kind of thinking about. Is it just yeah? I need gotta, to stop. Like, o I M is not the brand name. I don't mm. have a. I don't even have a brand name yet. So it's like, mm. I want to make clothes, and I'll make clothes. I make clothes on some like on like whatever, and like put no name on that bitch. I'll yeah. just make some clothes, make some five shit, put the five design on it, whatever, with no name on it right now because I don't even got no brand name yet. So when that come in factor. That's when everything is gonna really be. It's really gonna be there. When I get that brand name, that's when it's really gonna be there. Oh, word. I'm curious too, and we can cut this out if you want to talk about it. But how the fuck did you meet DC? Um, Cause I met y'all niggas together. I'm known DC for a little grit now. I'm known DC since like 2017, 18. Somebody like before like niggas had any type of motion. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Niggas were sleeping on couches and. Shit like that, and but like I, and so I'm from Florida, so I came out here, mm. and um I was with a nigga that knew him, mm. and I kind of just put up to the spot. They was on, um, you probably heard like Zola Crib. You ever yeah. heard Zola Crib? Yeah, yeah. Zola Crib. She didn't give to some stars, like she done, she yeah. turned some boys into some stars. I, I walked in there mm-hmm. on some shit, you know, it just looked like rap niggas trying to make it. So shit, I walked in there, niggas sleeping on the couch, niggas all over the crib, scrambling mm-hmm. this and that, and then um. First nigga I met was DC, like all, all through the door. Yeah. He was like, oh, what's up? This is uh, so and so. I talked to him, shot the door with him, and then we kicked it like that whole day. And then, you know, we tapped in, obviously. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, that's how we met. Like, it was on some shit. I met him at Zola Crib on some like quick shit, like, yo, what's mm-hmm. up? And then we just stayed tapped in after that. And um, as you can see, shit going up. It's just, it's just stay together. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's, 
It, yeah, like I, cause um, we we got cool and shit, and we was always cool. Stay tapped in on the phone. I come out here first thing I do is tap in with him, mm-hmm. and then um, twenty twenty I moved out here, and he was out here. We link and shit, and then that's when the shit caught caught up with him. He started going crazy. Yeah, and then um, hell yeah, we just stayed locked in ever since. Ever since like. We've been with each other like every day for like the past like two years. Damn yeah. Near. Like maybe like three now. Like we've been with each other like every day. Yeah, damn. I was, I was wondering. So, Cause I met y'all niggas together. Or no, I met that's him my, by himself, but I met my, you. It's my yeah. family. That's my brother. My words. Y'all niggas are hilarious. They're funny as fuck. But shout out to DC, wherever yeah. you're at. Hope you're doing all right. But um, I want to also kind of get into as well. <coughs> I want to get into as well. Oh, my God. <coughs> oh, my God. I fucking been choking on this fucking piece of rice for like an hour. Um, Hang on, bro. That food. I need that food. Bro, fuck it. It's just, <laughs> cut, it's just, just sitting out. <clears throat> fucking note to self. Make sure niggas eat before they come here. Cause what are you doing? But uh, anyway, so no, as far as from that, mm-hmm. how do you how do you think or how do you feel about relationships in the you know in your in the music industry? What you're doing, like how important are them? How how important are they? Like to your career and things of that nature, and you know, music relationships with other artists and shit, and just yeah, just or even just the whole gambit, the whole the whole circle period. You can say other artists as well. I mean, it's you know, networking is key. You know, networking is key, but it's like don't go in the room and want to be that like dick rider, damn near. Mm-hmm. Like, you don't you don't want to walk in the room and be like just a dick rider and niggas don't look at you like that. Like just be yourself and like. So I always do like I don't change for no one like you know what I'm saying like I walk in the room sometimes not even knowing who the fuck is who you feel me because I be in my own world sometimes I be walking in the room and then like I just be seeing lame shit like niggas be having egos and shit and I don't even be knowing them mm-hmm. I don't even know they rap none of them. niggas be having egos and shit like I ain't never been that type it's just do you do you think they're do you think they're I guess a let's say maybe like a number two factor of like kind of making it or blowing up or opening more doors. Or do you think that you could just do everything yourself and not just be that? Kind of I mean, have you that need, chip on your shoulder. You know what I'm saying? If you could, like, you need a team to go to the top. Like, you could do this shit yourself. You can always do this shit yourself. It makes it harder, though. But, like, you know what I'm saying? Let's say you with your group of people, bro, and you all going hard. Mm-hmm. It shows, like, it's a shine on y'all. So everyone is seeing, like, what y'all got going on. Even from the weakest link to the niggas, that's the highest. You feel me? Like, mm-hmm. they seeing all of y'all as that. Not even as a collective, but they just seeing all y'all and like knowing that everyone's tied in. Mm-hmm. So it's good to be tied in with good niggas and niggas that really want to see you go up and niggas that really want to see you shine and do your thing. Like it's you should definitely stay tied in because you don't want to be that nigga that's like, man, fuck all y'all. I don't, I don't need, I don't yeah. need none of y'all. I'm gonna yeah. do this shit by myself. <laughs> I got it myself. You know what I'm saying? Then you fuck around, you fall off, and then you try to come back, and niggas is like, bro, you weird ass nigga. I ain't trying to kick with you. Yeah. Get up on out of here. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. No, I just I think it's it's commemorable with the fact that it's like I said, you're around a lot of those people that would definitely, you know, help what you're doing. For sure, yeah. But like you're not for sure. Like I done been put in situations that definitely helped my music career a hundred percent. Like coming out here helped my career to an extent. Like it, it helped. What know? made you move? Just just to figure it out more or I was just tired. I was just tired of Jackson. I was like, let me Cause my bread was already straight, so I was like, I'm gonna come out here, and I rented an Airbnb. I rented an Airbnb for one month, and I came out for one month, and I was like, okay, fuck it, I'm gonna stay. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just you feel me? And I, I just stayed, and I was just like, shit, I stayed, and like my crib is here, but like I be in LA like mm-hmm. once a month. You feel me? Yeah, like, no, if crazy. that, nah, if that, this nigga, once yeah, a month man. is a cap because this nigga be here. A week. I'll be here at least once a month because I gotta swap my clothes. Out. I right. gotta, I might have bought new clothes. I gotta put up. Like, I'll be, uh, I'll give you that. It must be a month that I don't know. Yeah, yeah, it yeah it's whatever be. It's <laughs> <laughs> whatever nah, be. For sure. for sure. It's definitely good to, you know, stay tied in with good niggas and shit. Like, niggas that really got pure energy for you that really wanna see you go up. If, like, it's niggas that's like, you know, holding nuts on you, gatekeeping you from being what you need to be. Mm. Don't be around them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I done been in some rooms and like, you know what I'm saying? Like, none of these niggas ever held nuts on me. Yeah. So far, what I've seen, like, niggas always show pure love for me. Anytime I come around, because I don't walk around and just pretend to be something I'm not. You feel me? Yeah. See, that I walk in the room, you fuck with me. You don't fuck with me. I don't give a fuck. Exactly. I, you feel me? I don't give no fucks. 
That's a true statement because you always have the same attitude every time I met yeah, you. I don't, you know, I don't switch up for none. This, this is how, I'm. like, that's how, that's how I always been though. Like, mm-hmm. I just can't, I can't fake it. You know, yeah, no, it's like, okay. even off the rap shit, cause like the rap shit, I do this shit for fun, but I can't, I can't fake that. Niggas know I'm loyal to all my niggas and. You know, niggas that know me know what's going on. That's all I got to say. Mm. And I'm, 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 I'm knowing it's crazy because you don't promote any of your stuff, which is so crazy. That's I, mean, I know you still do it for fun. Do it for serious, nigga. You're fired. I, I need to. Like, that's why, like, that's why I need, like, management, I'd say. Management will help me, like, push it to the foot. I don't have niggas Destroy try to his comments. I don't have. <laughs> Destroy his shit. I don't have niggas try to manage me, and it just didn't. I don't know. They was always trying to do some extra shit, and I'm like, no. Nah. Or was you just not trying to listen? Um, I mean, it, it gotta it, go half and half. It gotta it, go half. It could have been that, but like niggas be wanting me to do corny ass shit. Yeah. I need a nigga that's really like. I need a manager. I need a manager, but like that's not on no cornball ass shit. That's yeah. That's it. Well, you guys will put all his all his Twitter and things and Instagram will be in the comments. So make sure you go fuck his comments up and be like, yo, let me manage you. But like you gotta really know what's going on. If you know, you gotta be really tapped going, in. You gotta be you know, tapped if in. You know what's really going on, and let's run it. Nah, I'm already knowing. Because you already see, I already be around, so it's like it's already the, the you gotta bring something to the table, pretty much. You want to make yeah, the hard work is already the done. You gotta, you gotta, you know what I mean. You gotta be bringing some. You're not gonna, you're not gonna, you're not, you're not a signer. You're not gonna sign. You're not looking to sign. Um, I mean, granted, you know, the bag yeah. is right, but is is that is that an option that you were that you've been thinking of? I've been offered a few few people, but like, nah, because it's just like one thing for sure about it. Like, I ain't signing no one that's gonna not push me. I ain't trying to sign a nigga, push get shelved, shelf. and then fuck around. Y'all getting percentage out of my shit, and I'm not. I'm not that type. Cause it's like my bread already straight. You know. Yeah. I already. I already get money. So it's as long as like if they could From push music. me, yeah. For sure, I and mean, clothes and shit like that. Yeah, but no, exactly. I mean, I'm just curious because it's like you know when people start putting out a, a tape of a magnitude that you're talking about, you know, they're usually you know searching for not searching, but like you know trying to see if you know get some you know budget for the you know what I mean whatever. So it's like I would I would like you know what I'm saying like I would sign with a group of like five artists okay. that like I'm like fucking with. Yeah. Cause like, and if they were like really trying to like push all of us to like push me, and I, I'd fuck with them. Yeah, but you're not trying to sign. To if it was like, like a, some like a house type shit, if it was like some shit that didn't make sense, mm-hmm. I wouldn't do it. Signing yeah. period, cause I just don't want them to like, you know, when you sign, bro, that's when you, you nigga, you giving your nuts away. Yeah, that's it. When you sign, you giving your nuts away, and you don't want to do that. No, it's you it. can't. You know what I'm saying? Right now, I can do whatever the fuck I want to do. Yeah, exactly. You feel me? Like <laughs> <laughs> after that, you fucking up with the brand at that point. Yeah, you, they start telling you to do different shit. It's fucking up how you were already going up, being yourself, doing what you do. Mm-hmm. Then you fuck around, you sign, and they tell you to do this and that. Like no, don't drop. No, do this, do mm-hmm. that. And it's like you blew up. You got motion off of doing what you already do. You might yeah. as well just keep doing what you were doing the whole time. Like like some people sign and then like they can't drop no music. They don't want them to drop no music. But I'm like. Bro, you better drop some because it's like, bro, there's so many artists out nowadays. It's like so many people making music. So you better yeah. get in where you fit in and keep dropping. I, I don't look, I don't see nothing wrong with dropping all the time. Yeah. If you making five shit, there's nothing wrong with dropping all the time. If you just making like a lot of like <laughs> mediocre, yeah. mediocre yeah, shit. Yeah, whatever shit. It's like whatever. And you know what I'm saying? Take your time with it. But if you yeah. in the studio, you making five shit every time and it's like, it's flooded. Yeah, it's flooded. Especially until you get to that level when you're a A-list artist, for sure. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? When you like a C-list artist and this and that, just keep going, keep going, keep going. Until you get to that level, it's like, yeah. it's, an, it's, an, it's anticipated for you to drop. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. Don't be like, I'm finna wait to drop when it ain't even that anticipated. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, nobody's looking out for you if you're, you, you know what I'm saying? Me? If, you, you if you're still me? only doing 2,000 streams, gang, you gotta you gotta drop a little bit more than I that. You gotta go crazy. You know what I mean? But I mean, look, man, I, I really appreciate you coming and sitting down and talking to me, man. You know what I mean? I'm happy that you you know had enough time and busy Marco schedule to come do this. Man, you know f- this is the first interview. Too, That's what I'm saying. So. This is first interview, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I hope we, you know, hope we, you know, we got a good mm-hmm. idea of what my man is about here. You know what I'm saying? Thanks. Damn, nigga, just threw his phone down. <laughs> he ain't gonna go fuck about <laughs> your phone, do you? God damn. <laughs> shit, both take a phone case. You know what's going on, man? That shit's strong. <laughs> <laughs>
I didn't even know they made Bottega phone cases. Niggas, they ain't know. I kind of want one. That shit's kind of fire. Shit, go ahead. Ain't, ain't too much to it. I fuck with it. This is my first, like, I ain't never really had no nice phone case. This is my first ever nice one. I don't even have a phone case. Oh, my yeah, it's just... tripping. I'll be, you know what I'm saying? I'll be high. I'll be on the go. I'll be having, like, <laughs> yeah, too nah. many phones. I'll get out the car, drop it, crack. I'm no, see. Straight nah. on that. I'll be, straight. See, I'm not going to lie. I've dropped this one mad times, and I'm, it's 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 surviving. You better knock on some wood. <laughs> the fuck? It ain't really no, <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, I ain't done it yet. I'm about to get a new one, though. You know what I'm saying? It's time. It's a new year, new phone. What is this shit? Oh, I thought it, it's a surfboard. It's a surfboard. I thought I was tweaking. This shit like an ironing board, a surfboard. They kind of the same thing, if you think about it. Iron and board or something. Oh, you just fucked my head up. <laughs> they kind of the same thing, aren't they? Bro, you just fucked my head up, bro. No, I'm just saying, that's the, the same. ironing board is shaped like a surfboard. It's the same thing. Bro, the it just has different material. What the fuck? Learn something today. Man, I don't need a surfboard, bro. I'm taking my ironing board out. <laughs> I don't Mama. Think it, I don't know if Mama. you... Have... <laughs> Mama. Mama, I'm sorry. Mama. I don't even know if it even flows the same, though, because it got like... Padding in it, right? It's like shit in the inside, so it might not like. It's like a boogie board, sir. It's a boogie board. You yeah, it's slick. Yeah, no, yes. It's the boogie board. We gonna ride out. It's a summer. Guys, I want you know this is we're out of time. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to how say. Long, how long we been going? It's like almost like 45 minutes. For sure, for sure. How long your episodes normally be and shit? 45 minutes. Okay, okay. It's about to be like 40 minutes, so I think it's a you know what I mean. It's a good overview. But yeah, guys, continuing. Here are my men. Any last words before we get out of here? Shit. Be yourself. If you're going up, keep doing what you're doing. If you don't see no progression, make a change. And uh, meet the standards project, working on it. Coming in a month. And two months. You know, I hope. Everybody waking up. I got shoes in the closet, still in some boxes. You can leave right now, I ain't holding hostage. Double M truck, made bag shit. Might crash a car if I take another sip. Baggy clothes on, can't tell if it's on my hip. Every day out the door, boy, it be a risk. I ain't even.